What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? It is your girl, Tiffany, and I'm back at it, y'all. I'm back at it with some more content for you. I know it's been a while. It's been about a month, maybe two months, since the last time that I picked up my camera and decided to record some content, but your girl had to get some things together so I could bring y'all what I need to bring y'all. So if you haven't read by the, the the text, the title of this video, and you just wondering why I'm doing this, go ahead, stick to the end of the video. I'm going to tell you why I'm doing this. And then, yeah, we should get everything clear. Everything should be out in the air. And then we can move forward. All right? So go ahead, stick to this video. Like I say, on all my videos, you won't be disappointed. But, hey. You might be disappointed. I don't know. Maybe the person I'm talking about might be disappointed. We shall see. All right? All right. All right. Straight to the video, y'all. Don't got time to be playing no games. You know what I'm saying? We done with games. This is 2022, so today is the day. I am exposing this person for who they are, and we're not going to do that anymore. All right? So this is what this video is about. I'm exposing this person. So if you're watching this video, you know who you are. This video is about you, baby. It's about you. Alright? So, here we go. Well, let's get right into this exposing. <laughs> so, this video is really funny to me because um, my videos are supposed to be quote-unquote positive. If if that makes any sense. Um, I know some of my videos, I could get really uh, into them, a little emotional. I could start doing my finger like this, cuss words could come out, you know. Um, but for the most part, it's supposed to be a positive impact on my videos. You're supposed to wake up, watch my videos, and be like, okay, it is different choices, different ways, different, you know, situations of handling things. So that's what this that's what this whole, whole, whole channel is about. Tiffany Dynasty is just seven different ways of doing things. Um, I have noticed that I like putting my fashion on there and all that. I'm going to start a whole nother channel for that because fashion and beauty in itself, that's a, that should be a whole nother video. So when it comes to the seven things, I'm either um, exposing people <laughs> or I'm exposing myself or I have went through something, whatever. You know, a pain shared is a pain uh, learned. So that's what basically my video is about. But today, I said, fuck that. Fuck that. I'm tired of playing games. This person needs to be exposed. And I'm going to expose them. You know, because we are living in the world of social media. So why not expose them on social media? Why not expose them? Everybody else doing it. So why should not? I? I said, let me have on this bandwagon of exposing people in their darkest time. So that's what I'm going to do. So this person right here, man, this person right here. This person has walked around with a chip on their shoulder for so many years. Like, this person has walked around like they shit don't stay. Like, um, somebody in the world owes them something. Now, I know that this person went through things as a child. You know, don't get me wrong. I don't I don't want to uh, say anything wrong about that. You know, because childhood neglect could really affect person as they get older because they don't know how to handle situations that they should have got as a child. So don't get me wrong. I know this person that went through them childhood traumas and they had some breakups and they had people do her wrong. Um, yeah, it is a girl. It is a female. And I'm talking about this little heifer that I'm talking about. Yes. Um, you know, we know. Life happens, life happens, but this heifer chose to, I guess, um, put on a mask. That's what they did. They put on a mask for the world. They walked around like nothing was bothering them. You know what I'm saying? They walked around like they could do everything <laughs> by themselves. Like they didn't need no help. To the point they didn't even ask for God help. Everything that they did was on their own control. You know what I'm saying? This person right here really was to the point I didn't even want to be around this person. I didn't even want to be around this person. We share the same blood. That's how bad it got. But um, this person was, yeah, this person really, I mean, probably messed up some blessings. Probably messed up some relationships. 
And this heifer's pretty old. I mean, this heifer is seasoned. I'm not talking about no young chicken, 20, 21. This heifer is up there in age. I don't know, I don't know why that this person decided to wake up with so much anger some days. Or why they even decided to go on vacation sometimes with this anger. Or uh, just bring the world this anger. Their children. Their significant other. Like, I don't know. It, it got to the point, like I said, I didn't even want to be around this specific person. This person was just, just... They said it in they shit for so long that it started to smell good to them. You get what I'm saying? And I was being around this person for so long, that shit started smelling good to me too. That shit started smelling good, man. That shit was smelling good. It started smelling like chicken and waffles and spaghetti, all kinds of food, right? But it was shit that this person was sitting in. And not only was this person sitting in shit, everybody around this person was affected. And for so long, so many years, this person thought her shit smelled good, literally. Like, this heifer really thought her shit didn't stink. This heifer really thought that she could have her own children, right? Have her own children. She thought she was doing the right thing until she started seeing that it was affecting her babies. And you know what's so crazy, y'all? A lot of my videos is about this person. This specific person. And I'm going to tell y'all who it is at the end. I'm not going to keep rambling on about this person. Because this person is no longer. After this video, you are no longer valid in my life. You no longer serve me. After today, I would no longer have anything to do with you. <laughs> Yes, you, baby. But this person did reach out to me. I could say this. I'm going to give her an E for effort. I'm not going to give her an A. I'm going to give her an E for effort until I see change. You know, because a person could say all day that they want to change. And then the person don't change. But for this person to be in my life and to go to the next destiny, the next stage, the next level. This person got to change. This person got to change, baby. No longer would I let this person dictate my life. You are no longer a factor. But like I said, let me not keep, you know, because once I start thinking about this person, it gets me angry, as y'all can see. I'm angry. But we're not going to keep talking about this person flaws person reached out to me the other day and said you know what I realized I have been the problem for so many years they said and one thing I respect about this person because even though this person told me their story this person didn't want no sympathy person didn't want no sympathy but you know it hurt them to know that they hurt so many people it hurt them to know that the seeds that they produced the seeds that God blessed them with that it was almost too late they recognized that they need professional help it's so much that God can do. It's so, almost, it's so much that one person can do. Like someone told me the other day, sometimes God uses moving vessels. I didn't understand what that meant, but today I do, as I'm telling this video. As I'm telling this story about this heifer. So a heifer is a small cow. I didn't want to call this person a bitch because that's a female dog. I'm actually looking for a bitch for my dog, which is a boy dog. So I don't call women bitches. Just a small cow. <laughs> so this alpha did come to me and said they wanted to change. Um, but this person has said that many times before. I have heard this before. 
and then they take three steps up and then they take a step backwards. So one thing I have told this person that I'm gonna always be here for you, but I'm only gonna be here for you if you change. I have no joy, no energy, no peace to give to this person any longer after today. And I hope they're watching this video. But yeah, the person came to me and said they're going to, they're going to get help. Um, they're going to do baby steps to be better. They're going to seek out professional help. Professional help. And you know one thing? In my generation, I'm not even going to say my culture. In my generation, we don't seek out help. We are told it's life. It happens. Get over it. You can deal with it. So we don't seek that help that we so desperately need, that we needed from when we were a child. I'm not even gonna get on the seven chakras. That's another video in itself. Yes, that will be on the line a couple of weeks from now. I'm not gonna get on that right now. But your chakras, man, and your chakras are developed as you age. And somewhere in your, your, your childhood, sometimes your chakras get off balance. And between different ages, from your crown to your foot, from your foot to your crown, to that third eye. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Yeah, but we ain't gonna go there. But like I said, this person reached out to me, told me they're gonna change, and that's what I'm waiting for. And when this person change, I know they're gonna be better because God has destined them to do good things, to impact the world. But they can't impact the world first if they don't impact themselves. And that's what I told this person. I said, baby. I didn't even call him a half. I said, baby. Baby. Get your help. Baby steps. Baby steps. We got a little homework plan going on of the baby steps that this person is going to take to be a better deal. And so, y'all probably like, why? Girl, why are you telling me this? And who is this person? Well, I'm gonna tell you, and I'm gonna tell you right now. This individual, this black, beautiful woman that was holding on so much pain for so long, it's me. I'm her, she's me, I'm that person. I would never use this channel to expose nobody. I mean, I like watching exposed channels and drama channels and all that, but I got too much time on my hand. I'm a full mother, full girlfriend, and not only that, they do, it look better on them. It won't look better on me exposing somebody else. You know why? Because my shit stink. <laughs> my shit stink by what I, so no. If you thought I was exposing somebody else, go bad. And like I said, most of these videos I put on here is about me. I just realized what was the problem. The problem's been me all these years, y'all. So today is the day that I'm being transpired with my channel. A couple of weeks ago, I identified what the problem was. It was me. A couple of days ago, I accepted that it was me. About a day or two ago, I let go of all the guilt that it was me. And today, reached out to my therapist. I actually have an appointment on Thursday, so. And this is years of should've been getting a therapist, y'all. Years. So, I'm about to end this video. Please expect more videos as your girls start changing, as I start revolving, as I start elevating. Please, please expect more videos. And then to the next time, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and man, Y'all gotta be honest with yourself if you're trying to get to the next level. So this video right here is about honesty. Honesty with my people, honesty with myself, and honesty to the world. A year from now, I expect to look at this video and it should impact so many people. But if it don't impact so many people, I don't care if it impact one. One is enough. I did my job. I did my job. Alright? So like I said, the next video, y'all be careful, cause safes get broken into. So y'all be careful in these streets, be careful in your home, be careful at work, be careful wherever you go. Be you, cause it looks better. It looks better, feels better too. 
All right, don't be nobody else. Don't look in their life, in their world, in their lane, and try to do what they do, baby, no. All right? Yeah, so expect two more channels coming from your girl within a couple of weeks. Expect me marketing myself on social media because I don't do that. So expect that. So I expect more subscribers by the end of March. Expect some giveaways. Expect a lot, y'all. Expect a lot. All right?